Hey you guys, welcome back to my beauty room. Oh my gosh, I have lots of little unboxings. I went to the thrift store today. I wanna to share with you all what I found. There was a couple gems. I did pick up some from eBay, pre-owned items, and a couple from Amazon. Go ahead and grab your snacks, your coffee, your drinks, whatever time of day it is, and let's just go ahead and get right into it. Okay, so what to start out with? I wanna start out with the eBay finds, and then we'll get into the Amazon, the two Amazon products I got, then we'll go into the thrift store stuff. Hopefully you guys are doing okay. I'm hoping that you do enjoy this video. If you do, don't forget to give it a thumbs up, and subscribe if you like these kinds of videos don't forget to push the bell notifications you guys it'll alert you every time i post a girly video and you'll be ready to watch it as soon as you get the post so let's get into this first box so i did already open up the packages but i haven't seen the item yet so this will be my first time seeing this I don't want to. I know that this one, I believe, is, is a breakable one. I don't want to drop it. Okay. I'm just in PJs, you guys. I like to be comfy when I'm in my beauty room. Anyways, yeah. Let's go ahead and get into this one. Let me get my scissors. Hold on. And a drink, too. Just a second. Where are my scissors? All right. I like to scroll on eBay at pre-owned items, vintage items, um, acrylic items, storage containers, and I came across this one. It's not acrylic, it is glass, but look how beautiful this product is. You're gonna see. Oh my gosh, look how pretty. <gasps> look how pretty this is. It is gorgeous. Look at the gold accents, the gold knob up here. It's glass. This is a vintage little piece here and it's just a little trinket countertop vanity little case that you can put your rings, your jewelry. So if I put it up here, Look how gorgeous that is, right? On these kind of videos, since they're pre-owned, I'm gonna try to get similar items and post them down below if there's not one exactly like it. So you can have options, you know, and you can come to this video knowing that there'll be some links and some products available. Next one. So this one I believe is acrylic. And they really wrap this one good. Look at this piece, you guys. It is an acrylic little vanity top container. And you can put anything you want in it. I think these are mainly for jewelry. This does have quite a bit of wear if I kind of angle it where the light is at you can see all the little scratch marks on it but I'm going to try my best to make it look very smooth with my plastic acrylic cleaner I get on Amazon maybe I can try to make it look a little less used you know it is all acrylic and the bottom is like a felt bottom so it won't slide or it won't scratch the surface of wherever you put it, whether if you put it on a wooden surface, a, a glass surface, a, you know, just whatever. Um, it'll prevent from sliding and from scratching that surface. So this is really pretty. It, do, it, do's. <laughs> it does have a fern, a little bouquet of flowers here. Very cute. Okay, so now we're going to move on to the... Amazon products. So I did get two items from Amazon. Let's go ahead and start with this one. Oh, 
So the reason I was intrigued to buy this item is because it reminded me of the Elf primers. Look how pretty. And you know what I'm talking about. I've never seen that this brand. So this brand is called Ruby Kisses. And this is the Pore Minimizing Face Primer. So yeah, it totally reminds me of the e.l.f. Let me see if I can grab the e.l.f. one. Okay, so here is the e.l.f. primers. As you can see, it looks very similar. Let's go ahead and swatch it, right? So yeah, this one's supposed to mimic this one. You see that? So this one is Poreless Face Primer from e.l.f. And this one is Pore Minimizing Face Primer from Ruby Kisses. So let's compare them. Okay, so this one is the Ruby Kisses. Ooh, that is so nice. It almost feels like a glue. Hmm, they feel very similar. And they have almost the exact same fragrance to it. What? Okay, so this one was the Elf. And then this side is the... Wow, it's almost the exact same product, you guys. But the packaging is like kind of cuter in a way. I know that e.l.f. has been changing their silver packaging to the white, so it kind of resembles this. I don't know who did it first, Ruby Kisses or e.l.f., you know. They seem so identical. And they have other makeup products, too, on Amazon from Ruby Kisses. Hmm. Yeah, to me, it's the exact same product. How pretty is that, right? So that one is a cool, cool find. I believe that one was $5.99 if I'm, yeah, if I'm not mistaken. Moving on to the next one. This one you're gonna really like. I usually don't buy shoes from Amazon, but I took the plunge with this one because look at how pretty this shoe is, you guys. Oh, look at a little sneak peek. Oh my gosh, Juicy Couture. Oh, I wish that it wasn't so dented, this box. So yes, these are Juicy Couture shoes. And this is something I wouldn't really order, um, but I just wanted to order it this time, especially for the price. It was fairly inexpensive. I think these were like $20, $22. You're gonna see, look how pretty they are. Pink tissue. <gasps> look how pretty they're like a duck boot a rain boot oh my gosh how pretty is this so it's all white and they're pretty lightweight they're not too heavy so this one is in a size seven i do have a narrow foot so these are a little bit narrow just so you know. And then in the back, it does have the Juicy Couture logo there. It's a little half inch, maybe a three quarters of an inch heel. Um, it has pretty good grip at the bottom. And then here's a little crown. How cute is this? Yeah, very, very exciting. So anyway, so here, let me take out both of them so you can see both. So here is your pair of shoes. I just love it. What do you guys think? Comment down below. And then you guys, look what I found at the thrift store. How pretty is this? It's a protruding shelf. So it has these little labels right here. It kind of gives it a cottage feel vibe you know as you can see it has about three inches of depth in there so I can put products on there 
and check this out you guys you can hang it up and this was purchased originally at home goods now you know a product like this is probably 20 either 19.99 or 24.99 something like that well i got it for 12.99 so it was definitely about half off it could have been a little cheaper but it looked brand spanking new with the exception of this but i think i can kind of soap that off but look at this product. I love it. It matches my beauty room. I cannot wait to hang it on the wall and put makeup products on it. So exciting. Oh, you guys, we have to back up. I was almost going to forget this. I did throw away the packaging to it, but this was pre-owned. As you know, I buy a lot of stuff pre-owned, but I saw this look at this let me show you it came in a set of two and the buyer or the seller still has more in stock so i will definitely link this down below i do plan on hanging these on the wall but check out how pretty this is so you just put all of your earrings you know if you want to it looks like a little store doesn't it so what i'm going to do is i'm going to drill holes up here and then I'm going to hang it on the wall and probably put little stoppers back here. So it can be kind of like a 3D earring wall case or holder, you know. And maybe I could put like a framing around it and make it look like they're framed art in a way. But yes, I put all of my pink Juicy Couture items. Um, and I just think it's so... Fun. it's unique like I said I will link it down below because the seller did have more in stock and these are just so so cool okay so now we're gonna move on to more of the thrift store finds as you know the last time I did a thrift store haul I did pick up some books that were my aesthetic my colors and, you know, I went and I always go by the book section and I ended up finding a couple more books. And let me show you which ones I got. Okay, so here are the books. Look how pretty they look. They're pinks. This one has an ombre uh, maroon to pink. This one is This Must Be Love. I like little sayings like that too, especially on books. Like I wouldn't normally get a book that if it's pink, if it says something like keto diet, you know what I mean? I wouldn't want to get that book necessarily, but stuff that has pretty little sayings on the covers or on the edging of the book, I will pick up, especially if it's my color scheme. I just think that it's a cute way to spice up a little section of yours. And I know that one of you guys had posted a short of how you purchased some books at the thrift store and you did decorate your little bookcase space and it came out so beautiful. It was green and pink and it just looks so lovely and cottagey. And But anyways, I just think that these are such a good idea to do that. And it's just a fun way to add color and dimension in your space here let me show you the titles so this one is the summer seekers by sarah morgan this one is rendezvous on the runway this must be love and then this one is quinceaneras and then the last one is dead reckoning it says it's a kind of funny book in a way like it's silly it's funny um but yeah I just like the way it looked I think she looks cute upside down her hair I don't know it's just it it was funny to me and I didn't see this here last time so I picked it up last bag so there is quite a bit of items in here they're just little gadgets here and there so the first thing I'm taking out of this bag is this little bell it's a glass bell it works you guys <laughs> and it has like little flowers and but I think I'm going to take off the flowers and do my own little ribbon flower floral thing here. 
this kind of looks old and droopy, so I'll take this off, put more ribbon, more pastel little roses, and yeah, it'll be a little cute little bell to have. Oh, how cute. I didn't even realize this. It says, precious and few are friends like you. How cute is that? So there is that one, and I did pick this up for $2.99. Next, okay, so I do see this one. All the red tagged items were half off, so this one was 99 cents, and all it is, it's a little gold stand that I think I'm gonna put like a, some bracelets or a little pair of earrings, of dangle earrings, and it'll just be like a little showcase on one of my shelves. So I just bought it for that for 50 cents. Use your imagination, you guys. You don't have to use the item for its intended purpose. You repurpose it to something that you want to do. So I picked up this. This is, I think you, it's meant to hold, here, let me show you. So it's meant to hold a remote and I think that's exactly what I'm gonna use it for. So I'm, um, yeah, I bought this. I know that they sell these on Amazon for like $5.99. I picked it up for $1.99. I thought that was a cute little find and it's so me because I love acrylic. Okay, and then this was cool. Um, it is a bit dirty, but I'm like, let me see if I can clean it up. And I don't think I'm gonna use it for what it's intended for. I'm just gonna have it because I thought it was cute. <laughs> I've just never seen something like this before, but this was 99 cents. And it has some missing rhinestones here at the top of the little case and uh, it's just plastic if you open it up it's a little cup like a little shot glass cup and yeah it's just a portable cup is what it is i do take medicines every day so like little stuff like this would be cool however i don't think i'm gonna use it but i just thought it was so cute <laughs> another item let's see what is this here Oh yeah, this one was $1.99 and look how adorable this little, I guess it's porcelain basket is with a little bear. Look at the little bow here at the top and little vines of flowers with ribbon. You can put your beauty blender in here, little tweezers and just have it on the vanity, you know? So it says on the back here of the basket celebrating spring with you. I just could not leave it there. It was too adorable. And yes, I had to have it for $2. One more item, last but not least. Hopefully you're liking the video. Okay, so this is cool. Now, here's the thing with this. This is a, this is a milk glass light fixture. I think it was supposed to go like on the ceiling. Like look, if I take this off, it has a little edge to where I think you screwed it on like a ceiling light, you know what I mean? But um, they had this with the ribbon. I'm thinking, wow, whoever put that ribbon there was thinking the same as me. You can put makeup brushes, planter. Um, but yeah, I just, I love milk glass. I think it is so pretty. This was only 50 cents because all the red tickets were half off. So for 50 cents, I found a little makeup brush holder. I mean, you can put whatever you want, you guys. Pens, pencils. How cool. I'll just replace this with a pink bow or something like that. Or maybe I can do little lace or, you know, make it my own. Yes, you guys, that is it for this video. Hopefully you did enjoy. Like I said, don't forget to give it a thumbs up. Don't forget to subscribe. I do different videos like this, girly videos, and I'd love for you to be a part of my family. We are growing. Give it a thumbs up if you did enjoy this video. And you guys, I will see you on the next one. Bye. Thank you.